Hey everybody, I am so excited to talk to you today about cream eyeshadows. They are brand new from Beauty Counter and I've been messing around with them, playing with them for quite some time now. And I'm gonna show you some tips and tricks of how you will love them, why they're better for your lids, um, why they last longer, and how to work with a cream versus just um, a powder. So it's really kind of cool how Beauty Counter again comes out with something that's like, huh, not sure if I'm gonna like it or not, but once you try it and once you mess around with it, it's so much fun. So I love anything makeup, um, it's art to me. And to be honest, I haven't been wearing very much eyeshadow, but I have been playing around with the cream ones. Okay, first of all, you have to prime your eyes. So you wanna make sure you have the concealer on and also, I'm loving the new primer. So this will also help keep your eyeshadow on longer. So first you wanna put your concealer on, or sorry, first you wanna put your primer on, um, just dab it around your eyes, and then put your concealer over top, okay? So that will give um, also a really nice metallic look with the primer, and the concealer is gonna um, hold it together, okay? Um, for and second is trying to decide what color is best for your eyes. So I had this on my page earlier. So it um, calls for blue eyes, hazel eyes, brown eyes, green eyes. And as you can see, I have the blue, so I can wear a lot of colors. I'm really excited about, um, if you have brown eyes or whatever, it will have the right colors for you. This is kind of what my, um, cheat chart of what I go off of when you guys have been asking me about what colors are best for you, okay? So first of all, eyes are primed, we're ready to go. These are not all the colors, but these are some of the colors that I, whoops, yeah, two of the same ones, that I can wear, okay? As you can see, they're mostly browns and a little bit of pink, and this one's gray, it's called Twinkle, and it has a really pretty color in it. So again, what I like to do is I like to first put on my light color. So the light color that was on my cheat sheet, um, I could do either Aurora, Gleam, or Luster. I pulled Aurora today. And you simply, you can, they show it on some of the videos, she's your finger, but I find using the brush is way easier. Um, but you just simply put it on, and this is great. I used it on Brittany's wedding this weekend, and it works so well, see? how it gives it a little bit of mica shine in there. And you could really just wear this color by itself. If you're looking for just a really simple um, day look, maybe you're just going to a ball game, um, maybe you're just going to football and you just wanna brighten your eyes, you would just put this on, okay? So you just put a layer on, you can go as high or as low as you want. And then you kinda wanna Go like this. I have a fan in my camper right by our bed, so I just stand by the fan. And then I like to use the brush. So the brush just kind of pushes it in so you don't see the line. And you can already feel it drying. So if you have um, dry eyelids, this is absolutely perfect. I use this on Sharon and Glenda for the wedding as well. This is my base, okay? So you just take it and you try to look down and just kind of go like this a little bit. It doesn't take much for, for it to set. And then um, next, you can pick any of your, your darker shades like this, okay? Um, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do this pink. I love this pink, it's called Haze. It's a really pretty, like a mulberry. It goes great with Western colors. <laughs> That's our school colors, so it's perfect. Um, and then this one, you can use as eyeliner. They have nice little tips that you can use as a liner too, or you can make um, a smoky eye, okay? Again, they're a little bit more forgivable. You just kind of put it on your eye where you want it. And I, I like to keep it more towards the end because I have smaller eyes. And then I just take my brush and I just blend it. You kind of want to press and blend in your arch. See that? All right, there you go. So I just use two colors. Um, I have a little light in the corner here and a little darker there. So. Um, you want to really press these more than swipe. That's kind of the, the idea behind it. But it does last um, most of the day for me if I don't touch my eyes. But it just depends different on everybody's 
eyelids. Okay, now I'm gonna use the Twinkle. This one has, I can't see it on camera. This has a little bit more like a gray, brownish two-tone. And so then this one, I'll do the same. Just keep it kind of tight to the end of my eye. And as you can tell, you're probably like, oh man, that's a lot of eyeshadow. <laughs> it is. Um, so then you just take your brush and you just mess around with it a little bit, okay? Um, maybe you find using your fingers better. I like to use the brush. I feel like I have a little bit more control. And you just press it in. As you can see, it just kind of melts in and just kind of forms to your conforms to your eye. If you want to go heavier, so the little tip, if you want to go heavier and use it like right along your lash line there, you can do that too. And if you want to go underneath, you can do that too. Make your eye just um, pop out a little bit more. So it kind of gives you that smoky effect as well. Okay. So there you go. I know some of you have been waiting for a tutorial. Um, but again, you just kind of mess around with them. You kind of put them where you want them um, on your eye. It's really meant to get you in. So now I went a little darker to get in and out of the bathroom. So I don't know about you. I just don't have time to sit and put makeup on. But now I have two different color eyes for you. But so this is more of my pink eye. This is more of my um, twinkle. So there you go. And then the best way I find to take it off is I love um, either our, our wipes are really easy if you just want to swipe it off or um, our makeup instant eye makeup remover. This is was part of the um, mystery bags. They're so cute. I'm going to be using this this weekend um, when we're gone. So if you have any questions, if you want me to help color match you and get you the right colors, let me know. I'm wearing um, Garden Party for lipstick. I love a bright pop, bright lip color. You know me. And um, find you something for some fun shades for the fall. All right, let me know if you have any questions. Take care.